Tonight, Crime Stoppers asked for your help to find burglars targeting pharmacies and taking narcotic medications. A pharmacy in China and another in Anahuac were burglarized within a day of each other, both losing thousands of dollars worth of medicines. KFDM Sarai Demine reports why one customer of Family Pharmacy believes a community effort can catch those burglars. Terry Radley is picking up medicine for her granddaughter at the family pharmacy in China. And it scares me to think those type of people are this close to our homes and can just invade uh, businesses like this because they can easily invade our homes. And that's where they're going to go next. This is where they went December 16th. The burglars took more than $40,000 worth of prescription medication, including Vicodin and Oxycodone. People think they're safe just because they're in small towns, but that's not necessarily true. The criminals took so much inventory, employees had to scramble to fill customer orders. We're also angry about it because they took a lot of the medications that our patients need, like for everyday use, and we went to try to fill the medication, and it wasn't there for us to fill, so that was kind of nerve-wracking. Surveillance pictures show three burglars with masks, leaving the pharmacy in a light-colored sedan. Police believe they are men. I hope they get caught, and it's going to take people like us to pay attention and like for you to get the word out there and for everybody to look. Looking for these men. So Terry Radley and her granddaughter don't have to worry the next time they go to the pharmacy. In China, Sarai Demin, KFDM 6 News. And Crime Stoppers will pay up to $1,000 for information that leads to the arrest of those suspects. You can call Crime Stoppers at 833-TIPS. You don't have to give your name.